Hey guys, it's Donna and I've got double Nadine West bags. So with my little break over the holidays, I ended up with two bags that were sitting there waiting for me. So I thought I would just unbag them together um, just to save some time and your time as well. Plus we can kind of compare the two bags and see which one we like the best. Um, Nadine West, if you're new to them, um, they're more of an affordable styling service. Um, it's only $10 for shipping. You do get that back um, when you purchase something in the bag. Plus they just recently gave my viewers $25 off if you keep the entire bag. I will leave the links and all the details below in the description. But with that said, since we have two, I think we're just going to dive in today and kind of see what they sent me. Um, I never know what I'm going to get with Nadine West, honestly. I do highly suggest leaving feedback um, because that helps any stylist know kind of what you like and what you don't like. If you want something specific, make sure they know. You can also decide what price point you want with Nadine West. They do send some accessories sometimes. Sometimes it's jewelry. Sometimes I've gotten scarves, things like that. So... That's kind of skinny of it. But let's go ahead and dive in. You want to be careful how you open your bag as well because this is the bag that you send your returns back in. They do give you a prepaid label. So all you have to do is stick it in here. You kind of reseal it, put the label on it, and put it in the mail. So it's really, really simple. I'm going to move my other bag out of the way for a second though. I have my full lap. Um, let's see what is peeking, peeking out here. So this is the one <laughs> from Christmas. Obviously, we're not doing stocking stuffers. Um, but they wrap them in little bundles. So here's my first bundle. Let's see. I know I've got another one in here. Let's see. Ooh. Hopefully it doesn't break apart. Okay, so here's my first two little bundles. I'm seeing some color, but also I'm seeing some denim maybe. Um, this is the prepaid label and then our little invoice we'll look at at the end. I will preface this by saying Nadine West does send these bags to me for free so that I can try them on and show you guys what you might get in your bags as well. So let's go ahead and dive in. Let's see what our first little bundle here has in store for us. So yeah, so right on top, we've got some darker, it looks like denim jeggings by Yaletti. I do like the Yaletti jeggings. I'm hoping maybe they'll start doing some straight leg ones to get away from the skinnies. I have tons of these um, from them because I've been partnering with Nadine West for a few years now. Um, so these are typically what you will receive for jeggings and Yaletti's fit very nice. They also wash and wear really well. I wear them around the house a lot. Um, these have nice pockets on the back too. And I do like this darker denim look. So that's nice. All right, next up looks like a burgundy top. This is by Roommates. Never heard of that brand. What do we have here? Okay. Um, don't know. It's like a long sleeve tee, I guess. I'm not sure about this pattern on the top. It's like Aztecan animal <laughs> print. And it's very wide um, for what size is this? I'm not really sure what size it is. This is size medium. So I guess it's supposed to be an oversized look maybe. So that's, I'm curious about that one. That's different. And then we've got a green plaid. This one's by DNA Couture, size medium. And it's soft. It's very, very soft. Um, I, the only thing that's bothering me right now, you guys know what I'm going to say, is these aren't lining up. <laughs> so the stripes don't line up. So that's a little bit bothersome. Um, but I'm going to keep my mind open. We do have like a roll tab sleeve going on here. So that's really cute. And it's very soft. So that's always a plus. All right, second bundle in the first bag, let's see here. Okay, so next bundle we have another pair of jeggings. This is the brand Love Sweet. Um, I mean, it's a lighter color, so I don't know if I'm crazy about that, but the bottom is an attempt at a raw hem, and I'm really not loving that. It looks like they just took some scissors to it and cut it up. Um, so I don't know, always keep my mind open. Um, we also have some teeny tiny pockets on the back course they're elastic so I don't know about those but we'll see all right and then maybe last oh we do have an accessory um I think in a dress it's a lot of material going on here but I can't find the top <laughs> all right here we go this is by Audrey Whitmore okay it's an extra large I don't know why they send me extra larges in dresses they usually I usually swim in them um because I'm a medium top so this top is already going to be huge on me and I'm feeling this is very dated looking. That is, that's not gonna work for me, but we'll try it on. And then we've got a sleeve that goes maybe to the elbow and then this really loose crossover sleeve going here. We do have a belt and it's a decent length. So I don't know about that one. Okay, and then I dropped my jewelry, hold on. Okay, so here's our jewelry. Let's see what they have. Maybe a necklace, it looks like. Yes, so we have a necklace. Thankfully, they wrapped it up really nicely. Sometimes they get tangled. Let's see. 
Hold on. Okay, here we go. So we have a longer necklace that has a bar at the end of it. Um, and this is by Tell Your Tale. I think that's really cute. That'll look nice on a more plain shirt. Um, so I think that's really cute. So there's our first bag. Let me grab the second bag. Round two. All right, second bag. Let's see what we've got. We've got two bundles again. There you go. Um, as far as how many pieces they send you, it varies. Um, I've gotten as little as five. I've gotten as many as eight. So it just depends um, on who's packing it, maybe. I don't know how often you do it, maybe. I I'm not sure. Um, we got another little stocking stuffer thing going on there we don't need. All right, so I'm seeing a chunky sweater. And I'm seeing some colors in this one. So I'm going to actually start with this one, smaller bundle. And let's see what is in here. All right, here's a pattern of some sort, a little crazy, but lots of material again, maybe a dress. Gotta love the dresses. We've got Vibe Sportswear. Again, a 1X, so this is gonna be too big <laughs> for me, most likely. Um, okay, I think it's cute though. So we've got like a brown and cream color going on here. We have short sleeves with a tie. The color's more fall, the sleeves are more full, but we'll go with it, and it's very, very long, so. All right, I'm not quite sure about that one until we get it on. All right, looks like maybe a pair of dress pants, which is nice. I do need some dress pants. These are by color five, okay, size extra large. Oh, I like those. Let me turn them around. They actually have a line going down the front, and then it has more of a flare legging or like a wide leg going on there. But I'm curious about these. I'm hoping they're a good length because that's something that maybe I could wear to work, which I like. All right, next bundle here. I'm really curious about this sweater. So let's go ahead and just look at that. Ooh, this is cute. J. Michelle of CA of California. That's cute. So Nadine wants to stick with these types of things. This is really cute. We've got some pinks and grays and creams. It's a nice cable knit heavier sweater. Um, it's really cute. We've got some ribbing detail. It's got some cute like edging on the bottom. So, all right, I think we already know the winner <laughs> is that one. Um, and we even have a purple top. So let's see. Um, white Rhino is this top, size medium. It's more of a work blouse. We've got some elastic going here. We've got more of a sheer sleeve with some elastic there. I don't know if I'm crazy about this color, but maybe it'll lay right once we get it on. We've got some pleating detail as well. So I don't know, we'll see. And then more jeggings. <laughs> these are, our, let's see, these are, I don't know the brand. I don't know. Um, looks like an extra large though. I, I feel like I have some that are like this. The buttons might say something, they just say jeans. <laughs> so these are similar, but these are the jeggings for the second bag, um, faux pockets, and then teeny tiny pockets there in the back. And then last but not least, we have another necklace, maybe. Let's look here and see. This is not wrapped as nicely. We've just got some loose chain going on here. Okay, that is exactly what it is. It is a very long chain necklace with some bigger chains and some smaller chains there. So again, I think that'll look really nice with the dress. So with all of that being said, thanks for your patience. Let's go ahead and try these on. Okay. Um, it actually fits a lot better than I thought. I thought it was going to be really wide, um, but it's not. It's more like they're trying to do a dolman here sleeve. Um, so it's okay. Just not vibing on the colors and the patterns. I don't feel like it's a now style. It was maybe a 10 years ago style, maybe. Um, but this design is really just awkward and weird, I think. Um, and I don't really like the continuation of the black on the sleeves. But it fits really nice. I like the length and I like the style of the actual shirt. Um, but gonna have to pass on the colors and the designs of it. Um, the jeggings are really nice. I already knew that they would be. Um, I'll probably throw these in my closet with all my other jeggings, but I love the solid color. They fit really nicely, very comfortable on my waist here. Of course, we're not gonna get any gapping. And the length is really nice as well on these. So I love the, the jeggings, but let's go ahead and try on the next top, hang on. All right, so here's our second outfit. Um, I think we'll just start with the plaid top. It's very soft, and I feel like that's maybe the only thing I like about it. Um, so the buttons are popping open, so I definitely would have to layer it, but it's so form-fitting that I don't think I have room for that. 
I did try to roll these, but it's too tight. So you could do the roll tab if you want to, if you love that style, um, but it's not working for me and my arms. I guess they're a little too thick, um, but this doesn't line up. So that really bothers me. Not a huge fan of the color either. Um, I'm not a big bright neon kind of person. Um, so this green's kind of off-putting to me. Um, so, and the color's kind of bothering me as well. So we'll just keep moving on. I just don't like the top, <laughs> but the jeggings are okay as well. I don't love these either. I'm gonna get a little bit further back. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see the bottoms or not. Um, so I'll lift that up there. They're actually a little bit too snug at the bottom for me and my comfort are on my calves. Um, but I don't love those bottoms. I just feel like a scarecrow right now. So don't love that. Here's the back pockets, little tiny ones. <laughs> so I think we're gonna just keep moving to the dress. Hang on. All right, so here's the dress. It's actually not as big as I thought it was going to be. I could definitely go down a size or two though. Um, and this doesn't gape open as much as I thought. I think it's okay. I think that it has pockets. <laughs> so I don't wanna forget saying that. They're low though, they're not where they should be. And I think that's because of the sizes of it. The belt does help, I think, to help cinch it in a little bit, but the belt doesn't continue around the back. So I don't know, and I'm not crazy about this design. The length is really nice. I do like the bottom half. I think that's really cute. Just not my style. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Uh, I'll give you the full <laughs> 360 here. I did pair it with a necklace, but you can't really see it because of the crazy design, um, but the length is really cute and I do like the necklace. I just didn't know what else to pair it with. But all right, with all of that said, that was bag one, so kind of put that in your head. <laughs> Let's move on to bag two. Hang on. All right, so here's the dress in bag number two, and it's big on me. <laughs> so it actually fits here at the waist, but everywhere else is just huge at the top. The length is super long. It's actually dragging on the floor here. Um, the pattern's okay. I mean, it does do vertical stripes, which is great, so it's a little slimming. These kind of bother me here. They're dangling. I might be able to tie them in a bow, maybe. Just not crazy about it. So we won't spend a lot of time on this anyway. It's very soft, I will give it that. Does not have any pockets or anything. I did pair, again, the necklace with this, but it's super long. Like, do you guys see that? I guess we could double layer it. That probably would be nicer. And maybe that'll look nice with the purple top. I'll try it with that as well. So let's just keep moving. All right, so at first glance, I really like this outfit. I love the look of this. I feel like it looks put together, but I wanna get into the details with you guys. So the blouse, I love this color. Um, I love this concept as well. The problem is the length of the top. So because these pants are so high-waisted, which is great, um, I do have to have it pulled up here because it's cropped. I mean, it is definitely a cropped top. So you have to have a high-waist pant with this and it bends under because of the elastic and maybe that's just my body, but that's the way that it's fitting. But it gives that tucked in look, which I really do like. Um, so I'm really curious to hear what you guys think about this top, um, but it does have that elastic that's high up. So that's the part I'm not sure about. But otherwise I do like it, I'm surprised, and the necklace looks a lot nicer with this outfit. But let's talk about the pants. So I really like these pants as well, but they're too long, unfortunately, and they're too snug on my thighs. So again, at a glance, they probably look great, um, but they're super long. So I would have to have at least black wedges, if not heels with these. Um, and I do like the line that runs down the front, and I like how wide the bottom part is, but they're just too tight here at the top to be able to wear to work, unfortunately. But we have the sweater, so hang on. All right, so this is definitely more my style. Um, I really love this sweater. I think it's perfect, it fits perfect. I already knew that I was gonna love this. I love the colors, I love the stitch, I love everything about it. The sleeves are really nice. They're kind of big and kind of like comfy and cozy. The length is really nice. And I think the stripes are really flattering as well. So let me give you that full view. I guess Bella likes it as well. <laughs> All right, and then lastly, we have the other jeggings. I have these already as well, and I think they're really nice. They fit really nicely. The waist is really comfortable, and they're more of a legging style, so there's no give really to them, but I like the solid color, um, and they hit really nicely as well at my ankles. The only bad thing is they have tiny pockets, so I wish they just wouldn't put pockets on them at all. But ultimately, let's look at these prices, and then you guys can tell me in the comments whether you liked bag one or bag two, so hang on. All right, so like always, I have some mixed feelings, um, but I do have some tops that I think are wins, especially like the sweater out of all of them. This is definitely my favorite, but let me know in the comments as well, what is your favorite piece? But let's look at these prices. All right, so we're gonna start with the first bag. Um, the necklace, this is the Joanna necklace in Rodeum, and this is $34.99. The dress is called the Yummy Dress in Blue Multi, and this one is $29.99. That's a good price for a dress. Just wasn't my style. 
I don't know which one is which. One of these is the D Dione Classic Skinny in Navy, um, and this one is $37.99. And the other one is the Illa Jeggings in Dark Denim, and this is $37.99. And then our tops, we have the Jillian top in red. Can't wait to hear your comments on that. $27.99. And then we have the Fiom in dark green and black. It's just $27.99. So, I mean, the tops are good prices. I think the jeggings are a little bit high, um, but I think overall the prices are decent. So, there's our first one. Here's our second one. All right, so let's start with the sweater before I forget. This is the Joelle sweater in pink and gray. This is $33.99. I think that's a great price for the sweater. The necklace is the Paula necklace um, and it is $34.99. Um, again, the pants, these are the Myrna navy pants. These are $37.99. Apparently all the juggings are $37.99. Um, and oddly, the Francis pants in black, these are $27.99. I feel like dress pants should be more expensive than jeggings, but maybe not. Um, the purple top is the Jennifer top in purple. This is $27.99. And then we have the dress, the Samantha dress in brown and ivy. Um, and this one is $34.99. So what you guys think? Don't forget, if you do want to try Nadine West, um, you can get $25 off of your full bag with the new code that's down in the description, and all of that details are below. So that is all I've got for you guys today. Please let me know what your favorites are in the comments. Other than that, please take a second to like the video and always subscribe. And when you click that bell, it'll tell you the notifications when my videos come out. Till next time, guys. Happy styling.